Former conservative MP Kenny Chu laid out his suspicion. He lost the 2021 election because of interference from China. My government is not there to protect me when it's needed. And he did it sitting across from the Liberal MP who defeated him and current member of the Ethics Committee looking into that very issue. Chu says Beijing spread propaganda about him being anti-Chinese within the Chinese-Canadian community. They target specific candidates such as myself. Chu stopped short of saying Baines should not be on the committee. Well, for his part, Baines had little time for questions. You know what? I have to catch a flight. I'm can, sorry. Can, can we on. ask you why you sat on the committee, even though um, there seems to be conflict of interest for you to be here? There's no conflict at do, all. Do you believe you won because of foreign influence? Nope. Not at all. Here in square. The seat in B.C. has flipped between conservatives and liberals for the last 12 years. And the civil servants appointed to look into foreign meddling found none threatened the outcome of either of the last two elections. The committee also heard from former intelligence officials saying Ottawa must do more to counter interference. CSUS has known about Chinese foreign interference in Canada for at least the last 30 years. Every federal governments, from Mr. Melroney to Mr. Trudeau today, have been compromised by agents of the communist China. We're allocating millions of dollars to the RCMP, I learned last week, with no investigative strategy, no prosecution strategy. We're just staying here. Take this money and use this. The prime minister denies inaction. This government, um, from 2015 onwards, has stepped up significantly our approach, or the approach that Canada takes on countering foreign interference. Trudeau's chief of staff, Katie Telford, will soon testify before committee herself. Rafi Bujikani on CBC News, Ottawa.